Grizzle's hiding in the cold lair, is he? Mm-hmm. Now that we know where he is, we must plan our next step carefully. Bagheera and the others have been helping us in secret, and thanks to them, we can defeat Grizzle. It won't be easy, but together we can win. Mm-hmm. <laughs> We'd find Akela helpless in his lair, Jocko, but we didn't find anybody. Uh -huh. I don't like this. I think Akela knew all along that we were after him. No, no. Ah! Akela doesn't know a thing. We've been keeping tabs on Lala, his granddaughter. If Akela knew anything, we'd have found out, I swear it. Then why wasn't Akela in his lair when we went there to attack him? How am I supposed to know that? Maybe you two made such a racket sneaking up on his lair that he had time to hide. What do you mean? Enough. Hmm? Stop being so ill-mannered. Jocko is our future leader. If you can't be polite, I'll find some henchman who can. <sighs> polite, I'll show him polite. <laughs> <laughs> Please don't be angry, Jocko. Huh? My henchmen are a little frustrated because they expected to catch Akela in his lair. And since he wasn't there, well, naturally they wondered whether you'd be giving them some bad information. <laughs> now they know it was an honest mistake. Right, boy? Right, boss. Fine, that settled it. But Jocko, if you make any more mistakes, you'll regret it, understand? Remember, Mowgli, take the sharpest stones you can find. You may need them to defend yourself. Other animals have fangs and claws, but you must live by your wits, Mowgli. You must use tools that you find in the jungle to protect yourself. You must use the skills Alexander taught you. You will need those skills to defeat Grizzle. Mother said I'd need sharp stones. As sharp as any fang or claw. When Mowgli returns with his stones, I'll tell you my strategy. Now try to get some sleep, everyone. We'll head for the cold lair at sunset. Understood? Mm -hmm. Bagheera, what did you find out? The wolves are ready for action. Mowgli was on the riverbank looking for sharp stones. Sharp stones? Yes, Ka, as sharp as your fangs or Baloo's claws. With stones like that, Mowgli can fight even a desperate enemy. I think the wolves are going after Grizzle tonight. In that case, we'd better prepare to follow them. Right! Those look good and sharp. I hope you won't be afraid to use them. Mm -mm. Now listen carefully. Here's our strategy. We'll set out for the cold lair this evening. If all goes well, we should arrive sometime before sunup. Mowgli is going to guide us. He's been to the cold lair before. He knows the way. Right, Mowgli? I still remember it well. It's a long and difficult journey, but we'll all make it. When the journey ends, our dangers are only beginning. Grizzle believes he's safe in his hideout, so we'll catch him off guard, but he and his gang may still put up a terrible fight. And they may have allies with them, like Tabaki the Jackal, but Tabaki is a coward. He has no stomach for a fight. 
If he's there when we arrive, he'll soon run away. That leaves Grizzle and his two henchmen facing the four of us. Mowgli, Akru, Lala, and me. Hey, wait a minute! What about me, Mother? I'm sorry, Sora, but you must remain behind with Akela. Uh... I know you're disappointed, but someone has to guard against a sneak attack by Shere Khan. But it's not fair! Sora, I'm surprised at you. This is no time to be selfish. Sora, we're counting on you. At least, I am. Will you stay here with Akela? Mm-hmm. Now, let's get back to our discussion about strategy. If Grizzle puts up a fight, we'll have to be prepared with a battle plan to face him. Akru, you grab his right hind leg. Lala, you take his left hind leg. That way, you can put Grizzle out of action without hurting him or yourselves. Mother, what about me? Mowgli, you stay close to Akru and Lala. Have your weapons ready. If Grizzle refuses to give up, you may be forced to go after him from the front. It's a dangerous job, Mowgli. Grizzle will be desperate by then. He'll lunge at you. Try to use your stones to subdue him without hurting him. Violence is an awful thing, but our survival depends on beating Grizzle. Don't worry, Mother. We're going to defeat that marauder. Mother, well, what should we do if Grizzle's pair of henchmen try to help him? Don't you worry about those two. I'll handle them. But, Lori... I'll be all right. Those henchmen won't defeat me. I'm counting on you, Sura. Look after Akela. I will. Good luck, Mother. They're moving, and fast. I'll follow them. Sure look like him. At this rate, they'll be there by dawn. <laughs> Out of my way, Ka, I'm in a hurry. Stand there. If you have a message for me, say it. <laughs> yes, sir. Mowgli and the wolves have set out for the cold lair. They know Grizzle's there. Mm -hmm. Are you sure of this? Mm -hmm. 
I'm sorry, Shere Khan, but I can't let you head for the cold lair to help Grizzle. Don't press your luck with me, Tiger. If I lose my temper, you'll regret it. Grizzle's henchmen are ruthless and cunning. Careful, Akru! <laughs> yes, careful or you might get hurt. If you think you can corner me that easily, you're in for a shock. <laughs> Hi there, Mowgli. Glad you could drop by. <laughs> Man cub, come join me. The view up here is lovely. Grizzle! Mowgli, don't! It's a trap, stay here! <laughs> My, what a nimble climber you are, man cub. Let me go! Mm. Oh, I don't like this. Not one bit. Never give up. I have no choice. Ah! <laughs> I know it's dreadful, but you had to do it, Mowgli. Grizzle would never have surrendered. Time to go. <laughs> Mowgli can handle things from here. Mother! Ah! Mother! I'm all right. Just a few scrapes. What about you three? We're fine, Mother. Your strategy worked perfectly. It certainly did. I'm glad to hear that. I hope Mowgli finds the healing plant. Hmm? Nope, how about 
this one. Are you sure you'll find it, Mowgli? Mm-hmm. Well, all these plants look much the same to me. Mowgli, if it was a human who showed you the healing plant, maybe humans have gathered every last one in the jungle. They tend to do that sort of thing. Hmm? Well? Found one! I said. You did? Yes! Why, that's wonderful! Look, Chill, here it is! <laughs> I have all I need right here! This will help Mother to heal! <laughs> 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 does that plant really heal wounds, Mowgli? It sure does, and it makes the fever go away. <laughs> Mowgli, I really don't like to pry, but what will the pack do about Jocko and Dusty? I don't think we have to worry about them. Perhaps not. But the problem is worse than just a couple of foolish wolves who tried to take over. Your pack needs someone to replace Akela as leader. Mm-hmm. I suppose so. But no one has stepped forward to claim the leadership. And frankly, I can't think of any wolf who's fit for the job. Unless, of course, you count Vermilion. Huh? I know this is a touchy subject for you, Mowgli. You think Vermilion left because of you. I think he had his own reasons for leaving, but what difference does it make? The point is, he's gone, and someone has to bring him back. Otherwise, wounds will open in the pack that no plant can heal. Vermilion. Hmm. It's all right. It just stings a little. Mm. Keep putting it on. There we go. You'll be better in no time. Wish I could say the same for the pack. Mowgli, I've been thinking about your conversation with Chill. Bagheera and Baloo have both told me they too wish Vermilion would return as leader. The other wolves miss him, but they keep quiet because they don't want to hurt your feelings. Even I wish Vermilion would come back, Mowgli. Uh-huh. Akela is old and tired. He wishes a successor would come forward, but no one has. And no one will either, which is why I have a favor to ask of you. A favor? Yes. I want you to find Vermilion. Speak to him. Convince him to return and lead us. What? Mother, you can't be serious. Yes. I would go myself, but I'm still recovering. So I've chosen you. Only you can persuade Vermilion to return. You have the courage that your father taught you, Mowgli, and you have the quick wits of a human. I know it will be hard, but look at this as your chance to repay the wolves who raised you. Convince Vermilion to come back. At least try. You owe it to the wolf pack. <sighs> To find Vermilion, follow the great river upstream to the Chudri Heights. Chill knows the area well. He'll help you find it.
These are the Chudry Heights, Mowgli. Good luck, my friend. Thanks. So long, Chill. See you soon.